Oh, hey girl, what's up? I like your hair today. So right now my sister, Megan, is in cosmetology school and she's learning how to cut hair and do all that kind of stuff. And for her school, she has to have little, um, what do you call this? Heads? Mannequin hands? Figurines, these statuettes. She has to practice her hair cutting on them. Girlfriend's got some dandruff. Anyways, they've been creeping up in my house a lot. Like, I'll come home from school and I'll, I'll just be, you know, wanting to eat something. And I'll open the pantry and look. There she is. I don't know, she's just everywhere. It's like wherever, wherever I go or wherever I turn, there's... There she is looking at me. It's really creepy. I just want to talk about her for a bit because she's just so beautiful. I just feel like it needs to be expressed through YouTube. Um, I think her name's Bridget because that's what ri that's what is written on her neck. I think it's a little bit um, degrading to her to have her name written on her neck though because I mean my name's Alexis but but it's not like Alexis. She she can't have that air of being mysterious because everyone just knows everything about her right up front because it's written on her neck, you know? And you can also see right up front that she's from China, so it's, it's like telling her ethnicity, her name, basically her, her whole identity is just written on her neck here and I think that's just degrading. The way they did her makeup, I like that. They did her makeup in such a way that it's just so up to date and so in style and realistic. Um, let's just take a look at her eyes. First of all, let's notice the color blue used in her eyes. It's just a really, a really realistic blue. Um, you know, it's kind of aquamarine, I would call that color. Aqua. You can see they have this smoky eye look going. They didn't give her eyelashes though. I don't know why. Her eyebrows here. You can see she doesn't have very many hairs in her eyebrow. But it did shade it in to make up for that. Uh, her lips are a nice shade of, of dark peach, which is just lovely. And I just think that just enhances her features. Kind of, I think they're trying to make up for the fact that they just threw her name right on her, you know? Hey, I'm Bridget. And she hasn't even said anything yet. It's like, hey, Bridget, I'm Bridget. Bridget, Bridget. I think it's kind of creepy, though, because I'm pretty sure this is human hair. That's a little bit weird. I think. Who do they get this hair from? Do they get this hair from people who donate their organs? Because technically hair is kind of an organ. Or maybe it's from people who do locks for love. Or, you know what? What if they stole it? What if they took, what if they snuck into a girl's room, cut off her hair, and put it on this mannequin, you know? It's just mysterious as to where they get the hair to make these. I don't know. It seems a little shady to me. A little bit shady. Anyways, I just wanted to talk about her for a little bit. You know, she deserves the attention. I wonder how mad my sister would get if I cut all her hair off. I wonder how much these things cost. Maybe one day I'll buy like a hundred of them and just put them all around my room and then have somebody come over to spend the night or something and just see how they would react to that. And if they ask, if they ask why I have so many heads around my room. I just don't like to be lonely. I keep me company. A bunch of Bridgets. How are you? How are the kids? How's the husband? How is everything? I just want to hear about your life. How's your life? Tell me about your life. How is it? Tell me about it.